Love Islander Tasha Gori has revealed boyfriend Andrew Ola Page has been a voice for her since leaving the show. The couple met on the ITV program last summer where she fell head over heels for her now boyfriend, Andrew. Tasha broke Love Island history by becoming its first ever deaf contestant but admitted she didn't expect to find someone like Andrew. The model and deaf campaigner, 24, had her reservations about connecting with someone on the popular show and questioning if they were there for the right reasons. She told The Mirror, I did not expect to find someone like Andrew on there to be totally honest. Because I feel like you don't know who's there for real, like, who is actually really there for love. So I feel like with Andrew and we started to connect I like, oh you can find really nice people on the show. Since leaving Love Island, Tasha and Andrew have grown closer and the pair have matching tattoos. Last year, Andrew surprised Tasha by getting an ink of a hand signing I love you in British Sign Language, and holding her cochlear implant. When he got his tattoo, I couldn't believe it. When he walked in, I was you got a tattoo, what? Tasha explained. I guess it just shows how much Hess wanting to be part of the deaf community as well. And has always been a voice for me. Sometimes he educates people as well. I think that's amazing because that's how it should be. Your partner should be like your rock and vice versa. Tasha gushed, I think he has just been amazing. I just have no words for it Hess just a great guy, kind sweetheart. And he really is just there for me. The Love Islander previously opened up about the pressure to act a certain way because I wear a cochlear implant throughout her time on the show. Going into the show and really wanting to show people that just because you have a superpower, it doesn't define you, it's just part of something special that you have, the star explained to her fans on YouTube. And coming out of the show and seeing some of the comments that people were saying about me, that I should act a certain way because I wear a cochlear implant because in deaf is so stereotypical. There is no certain way a deaf person should act ever. Tasha was a campaigner for the deaf community before she joined the show and has continued her work since. She recently got an exclusive invite to attend King Charles' coronation concert through her work for the Royal National Institute for Deaf People, which Queen Camilla is a patron of. She revealed, I didn't expect it at all. I think it's because I do a lot of charity work behind the scenes that not everyone really knows about.